Who knew there would be all this anger over a parking spot? What's up guys, it's Ken from the Disney Movie Review, and of course I'm talking about the new news that Disney will begin charging Walt Disney World hotel guests for overnight parking. Now they're doing this because they know that they can get away with it. Of course, if I was to say in this video that I'm no longer going to Disney World because of this policy, I can already see the YouTube comments of people saying, good, get out of line, there's more magic for me, and that means shorter lines for me. But for me, this is about more than just a parking spot. This is about Disney as a company. Disney said they're doing this to, quote, align with industry standards. Now, Disney has always been above industry standards as a company. They've been beyond them. In fact, Walt Disney set up this theme park to be above anything that anybody was offering during that time. And Disney employees have a famous two-word mission that is above industry standards. It is create happiness. But I feel like the mission of the frontline cast members that you and I talk to every day is different than the mission of the cast members that sit in the corporate office. I mean, does it create happiness to limit capacity in rides so that you have false numbers of crowds and you can end up charging more for tickets? Does it create happiness for a little boy to get a Battlefront 2 game only to find out that he has to pay more to play with his favorite characters? Or does it create happiness for hotel Tell guests to have to ch pay more to stay at a Disney hotel? Or does it create happiness for Avengers Infinity War to be released a week early? Actually, that does kind of bring a smile to my face, but you get the point. This is about profit. Plain and simple, the people in leadership now at the Disney company are expert cost cutters. They are expert profiteers. They are experts at making the shareholders receive a certain amount of revenue and keep the money flowing. I'm not going to say I'm never going to go to Disney World because of this policy. I mean, if history is any indication, I'll be there within the next 16 to 18 months. However, I will say that I think Disney needs to change the mission for its frontline cast members. I think they need a new mission, two words that align with what this is going on in the corporate office. I think they need two words that will show the customer exactly what Disney thinks about them. I think they need two words that they want their, their employees to think about before they think about doing anything else. Create profit. We'll talk about this much more on the Disney Movie Review that comes out, the podcast that comes out on Monday, which you can find on the DisneyMovieReview.com. And until then, my friends, have a magical day.